I know I already made one video today. <laughs> I'm Darlene from Darlene's Garden. But I wanted to show you my new de food dehydrator and show you how I made my kale chips. So here goes. Okay. I tried recording this without turning my recorder on. <laughs> I got a new dehydrator. It's the first time I've ever had one. And I decided today to try it out for the first time. I made kale chips. So I had kales that needed to be picked. I cut them up into little pieces and, you know, took all of the, all of the middles out. And then the recipe I was looking at called for nutritional yeast and garlic powder. I wanted it to just be simple. I just used some olive oil and just a smidgen of salt because I wanted my kale chips just to taste like kale chips. So I had three of these loaded up. As you can see, I've got quite a few here. And they were pretty easy to make. I just went and picked my kale, cut them off the, cut the leaves off of the stems, loaded up my, my, um, whatever these are called. And I see some little dinky pieces here. And I have three, three of these. I could have gone by, gotten less, but I could have done with less if I'd loaded them up a little closer together, but I wanted to make sure. And then my, my dehydrator is kind of a cheapy one, so, well, I don't think cheap. To me, cheap is relative. Anyway, it doesn't have a temperature setting on it. And so I set it, I set my alarm for an hour. And I went a little bit past that because I was busy doing something else, but it looks like it was just right. You can, you can hear the, yeah, so. And, yeah, good. Okay. So that's it. making my, my, dehydrating my first batch. You know, I think it would have tasted good with a, I don't have any nutritional yeast, but it would have tasted good with the, with the garlic, but I like it plain too. Anyway, this is the kind of dehydrator I have. Other thing that I got brand new this week is a KitchenAid. It's a small food processor. So, and I already had the instant pot. So, I haven't used my new KitchenAid food processor yet, but I will. Not to fear. I see some tape I need to take off of there before I use it the first time. Well, that's it. Wanted to show you that. Tell you how I made it. See you next time. May the good Lord richly bless you. Bye.